Hi guys, thanks for joining me. I am Dr. Ayele Okine and this is This Vet Wants You to Know. Today I have another tip for you. This time it's for cat owners uh, and I guess small dog owners. Um, but please, 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 please get a carrier with a top that opens easily. When your cat goes to the vet, they're stressed. They don't wanna be there. They don't wanna come out of their carrier. Um, I know it was probably hard to get them in the carrier in the first place, but once they get to us, they do not want to come out. And trying to go in after an angry kitty fakes first or putting our hands and, and arms into a carrier um, is very difficult. So if you have a top that opens, please do not use any sort of um, ties or bolts or anything that can't be removed. Um, in some cases, we actually do have to cut them off to get the kitty out. But ideally, we would have a top that opens easily so that we can uh, get the kitty or even take the whole top off and put a blanket or a towel over your kitty. Um, in a lot of cases, if they can't see us, they're not as afraid and so it makes it a lot easier for us to get them out. If for some reason the top is um, zip tied shut or closed in some other way or there's no easy top to get them out, we often have to dump them out. So actually tipping the carrier over um, and that is very traumatic. So if you can invest in a good carrier with a good top and don't seal it shut, it really makes things easier for us and for your kitty. Um, so that's my tip for the day. Thank you. If you like this video, please subscribe and follow me. I have a lot of great tips coming down the pipeline. I also have a lot of videos for you, educating you on different diseases that we see in both cats and dogs. Thank you.